The first and 10 camp tour headed to the Dogwood District and a check on a, a state power, folks. Appomattox County's Raiders, the power of one. Apo reeled off five Class 2 state titles in six seasons through the spring of 2021, and they were region champs again last year, but fell in the state semifinals for a second year in a row to Graham. And while that is a hugely successful season for most teams, you get the feeling the Raiders are hungry to get back to the top of the Class 2 mountain. To Thanksgiving weekend has been the standard we at least want to meet every year. Um, but now we knew we had to work a little bit harder in the offseason to, if we get, want to have a chance to get past that, try to win a couple of our out-of-district games that we lost last year um, against really tough teams. Rustburg, Heritage, Botetot got us. Buckingham's going to be a tough county rival game. We know we need to get more physical to play with those bigger schools that we had early in the season. Motivates us because it's like we came so far and ended up short. And we don't want to repeat that again this year because it's happened the past two years. And I think everybody's just really like focused in and dialed in this this season. Everybody's getting stronger every day, coming to workouts every day, not missing days. And uh, we've been this team's been way more physical. Physical like last week had a whole lot of injuries because people were getting physical. But that's a good thing though. And I would be remiss if we didn't send out our best to head coach Doug Smith. This is file of coach as he is not at practice every day as he undergoes another round of cancer treatments. Smith is still watching film and leaving notes on scrimmages and practice film for the players. So make no mistake, the leader of the power of one still watching over his Raiders.